Yom Tarih Bilcan Orientation Day among the others. Let's see what they have. Okay, let's see. This is here is the orientation day about the university. How are you? So different faculties. Eighteen faculty. Education. Health. Yuxik. I think this is master. Faculty of Engineering Friends. Okay, here is the physical therapy. Uh, Adalet program. Uh, justice. This is different. Other. Dialyz program. Ilk ve acil yardım. This is the first aid program, I guess. Okay, here is uh, Mr. Uh, Sir. Uh, Assistant Professor of Second. Okay. Department. Physical therapy department. You are lecturer, is it? Uh, yes. Lecturer. Okay. Nice to have you. Nice to meet you. We we would like to promote the university for some international students who are interested. Yes. So have. maybe you can explain about the the course. Yeah, we actually the you know uh, giving the, the basic the health science. Health science. Yes, and after that the first two uh, years round. Uh, our students learn the anatomy mm -hmm. and the physiology and the human body movements and the basic measurement of the, the, the movements and the muscles okay. and actually musculoskeletal uh, how, how many years applications. is the, the four years four years uh, yeah. okay giving the education on the health side and there there will be a preparation year is it yeah, preparation, there is no preparation for the, 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 the English because the are uh, All the courses language, yes, or in Turkish, Turkish, but for international students, they have to they, join uh, they Turkish have to language? Join the Turkish yeah, preparation. You need to be, you know, the God of uh, outside. Outside. Okay, so they have to, to come and be ready before they uh, yes. coming, joining the university. Yes. Okay, yes. okay. And we have actually the foreigners. Uh, in our faculties and then the physical mm -hmm. therapy. Mm -hmm. uh, Which department. countries? Uh, generally Asian. Uh, Asian? Yes. Oh, Syrian, really? Kyrgyzstan. Kyrgyzstan, yes. okay. And, uh, I think the, the, our, one of the professors of the defense the, and also the uh, chair about this. Okay, foreigners. okay. Actually, I know the three or four uh, of them. Two of them is the graduate this year. Already, yes, will so graduate. Graduate and get their diplomas. Mm -hmm. And uh, after the two years, the third and four years, actually, uh, the education, the giving for uh, special science, for example, the rehabilitation lessons, mm -hmm. and the, the our students connect the first two rounds of year the basic uh, educations to join the other rehabilitation science, okay. mixing to all education or information or the, uh, knowledge about the bodies. Interesting. Actually, so yeah, last let, year, let me ask what kind of departments you have? We, we have actually physical therapy department, but on the third year, the our students learning the orthopedic rehabilitation, cardiopulmonary rehabilitation, Sports, health, and can, Is it shown here the list of departments? Ah, list of departments. Inside the health, this is all under the health uh, faculty, yeah. is it? Okay. We have nursing. Nursing, okay. And, uh, nutritional and physical therapy. Actually, three, three programs. Three programs. Yes. What is the fees? Is it four thousand dollar for international uh, students? Yes. Actually, the nursing, uh, 25 Turkish lira. 25 Turkish lira, maybe for local students. Yeah. I, I guess 4,000 dollars, something like that. Okay. And nutrition and the physical therapy is the almost 30,000. Turkish lira is 5,000 lira. Is there a specific requirement for the students who would like to join? Uh, Especially international students? For international studies, the highest Actually, they just uh, you know, the, know the Turkish first. Okay. Our education programs just in, in Turkish. Turkish. 
but we have the programs, Erasmus programs, for example, European Russian, doesn't matter, they can uh, join the, our programs, mm -hmm. but they need to come with the Erasmus exchange programs. Mm. For, for example, nobody is in the university and want to come there, first we take the, our first exam, mm. the AM. Let me highlight one of the advantages here. You have Erasmus program where you, your student also can go to Europe yes. to take some courses, I guess, for a few weeks, is it? Yes, uh, actually, you know, adaptation around one year because the, our transcript or the, or the other countries need to be, you know, the, um, I don't know the English name, but you need to be the equal for the equivalency. Okay. For example, one or two lessons is nothing for them. You need to complete the whole courses on the country. Okay. After that, you can be equal and then you can work okay. in that country. Okay, okay. And so, uh, there are advantage. The health science is very strong there. I'm mm -hmm. powerful. How many students we have? We have uh, this year uh, 472. Mm -hmm. Both three programs. Okay. And this year we graduate 119 mm -hmm. mm -hmm. okay, 115 nursing. Okay. And 100 almost 100 nutrition. Nutrition. Mm. I will. I think that professor is the person in charge about nutrition. Four professors on the nutrition program. Mm -hmm. Two professors and five assistant professors in physical therapy. Mm -hmm. And four professors in the nursing and also the assistant professors. Okay. Mm -hmm. Almost one teacher or the lecturer, ten students, giving the, you know, the percentage. Mm -hmm. Ten students for, for ten students. One lecture is good, good percentage. Oh, okay, okay. So, okay, oh, so you can go up. University is just, you know, two or three assistants and one mm. And it's important because we don't give our education ourselves. What about the labs and facilities you have? Is it, uh, is the education in somehow practical education? We have very good uh, Simulatory laboratory mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and practical and uh, electrotherapy laboratories, anatomy laboratories. Interesting. Our students taking the lessons like a practice. Okay, practice. And applications, especially in nursing. Mm -hmm. Uh, this kind of technology laboratories, the chemical laboratories for the nutrition, we have a good opportunity. Uh, uh, very good uh, the architecture. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, our buildings very near, mm -hmm. especially for physical therapy. Okay. We built the three floors and one there is a center mm -hmm. for the physical therapy center. Okay. Uh, Interesting. They, they together, you know. Together. And our students be taking lessons, going to this clinic and applicate what mm -hmm. they learn. learn. And let's say if the student, a student would like to join the university, what time he, what is the limit, what is the deadline to come and join, to join next semester? Uh, we, we have actually the, uh, the end of this uh, I will tell to you. And this <laughs> it's 29 of this month yes, is the uh, uh, application period yeah, the after period. acceptance after acceptance the he has to come for registration on September I guess one week later the results is result it comes yes. okay and then he will he has to register uh, in September yes okay yes. okay it is clear thank you so much Okay. Right now, yes, why not? This is uh, Dr. Bilal from Political Science and International Relations. I guess this is one of the um, uh, few uh, faculties and departments in the university who are teaching in English.
Sure. Okay, so let us know more about your English program. <coughs> okay, now uh, I am in International Relations and uh, Political Science Department. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the most characteristic uh, of our uh, you know, department is uh, almost all of the faculties are graduated from outside, from uh, the US, American universities, uh, and uh, from the European universities. Mm -hmm. And uh, another important feature of our uh, department is almost uh, every day our faculty are on TV uh, for live uh, debates mm, sure. about you know what's happening in Syria, what's Good. happening in uh, in the US. So uh, a lot of your lecturers in world, are involved about the issues and analyzing. Exactly. They are also public intellectuals. Interesting. Uh, they are also okay. public intellectuals. Uh, they speak English very well. They, they uh, spend a quality of time, quality time with the uh, students. Great. Uh, there is very little border between the students and the professors. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, uh, we try to help students in every way we can. Great. Uh, support them even after their graduation with our uh, reference letters, mm -hmm. with our uh, networks. Mm -hmm. you know? And I noticed that few of your uh, Maybe students or staff is working in some top uh, research centers in Ankara and Istanbul. Sure, yeah. But one of them is, for example, SETA. SETA, uh, yes. And this is one of the think tanks that actually guide uh, the, the government, almost all of the governments that come to the head mm -hmm. in Turkey. Mm -hmm. uh, another thing is that, you know, uh, when our students graduate, uh, they have a wide range of areas to work in. Mm -hmm. For example, one of the first ones is to work in the government organizations. But then, of course, uh, for example, uh, some, of the, uh, some of our students went to United Nations uh, mm -hmm. to work. Uh, mm -hmm. They were accepted. Mm -hmm. And, uh, for example, what was important for United Nations, uh, if our students could speak two languages, for example, Arabic and uh, English, English uh, and Turkish, in most to of Turkish, Turkish mm -hmm. they were easily employed by the United Nations. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There are so many civil society organizations uh, where our students work. Uh, of course, European Union and uh, NATO are uh, some of the other institutions that are uh, Interesting. 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 Uh, Interesting. Uh, so, international relations <laughs> in an area where students can find a wide range of jobs. Mm -hmm. uh, as I said uh, before, uh, but of course, in private sector, they have also a lot of chances if they have uh, a good level of English. That's great. What kind of programs you have, uh, departments for undergraduate students? Kind of courses yes, not only the courses but programs. Do you have only uh, political, yeah, political science and international? So, two departments or only of this is also include, uh, includes uh, we call it community, it means public administration. Okay, we also include uh, public administration uh, courses. So, this is under which faculty? This is, uh, in Turkish, we call it iktisadi and Okay. Which is called uh, management and of economics and social sciences. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so you, this is your department under that. This My depa department is under uh, faculty of economics and uh, social sciences. My department is political science and international relations. Mm, okay. And uh, do you have a master program? We have a master program in English as well. Great. Uh, which is really integrated into European system mm -hmm. uh, and. Uh, our students in that program are generally from international backgrounds. Mm -hmm. uh, again, you know, there's a very high quality uh, program. You know, mm -hmm. it's a very high quality program. Uh, and students that are involved, they experience that quality. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, really, students don't need to go to uh, England or US to get that level of education because. Our professors are educated in the U.S. and in Europe. Great, great. Yes, I can note that. Um, what are the requirements for the international students mainly to join the undergraduate and postgraduate? Uh, I think uh, if you talk to social sciences, uh, you know, graduate uh, departments, they will, uh, you know, mm -hmm. inform uh, more details about this. Uh, okay. But, uh, the qualifications are not really that difficult. Okay, okay. You know, there is a GPA, maybe uh, a criteria, and there is also a language criteria mm -hmm. that the students have to, uh, you know, fulfill. But then there is also accreditation, you know, whether they are uh, graduated from an accredited institution or not. Okay, okay, got it.
Thank you so much for these details and uh, have a nice day. Thank you very okay. much. Okay, well, thanks. So uh, they are also from the same department, is it? Okay. Okay, good morning. Uh, this is the education faculty. I think you are... Uh, uh, how many uh, departments you have? We have five departments in the education faculty. <coughs> five departments, okay. Five departments, yes. Uh, preschool education. Which one? Preschool, preschool education. education. Uh, special education. Uh, English literature. Mm -hmm. um, uh, primary education. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, so all of these are bachelor degree or no? Uh, bachelor, yes. Okay. Let me stop this color. Continue with you. Okay. Uh, bachelor uh, degrees. So, um, what is the how? What are the requirements for the international students to join? We haven't any uh, international students uh, yet, mm -hmm. so uh, we couldn't go to the international students, so mm -hmm. I want mm -hmm. to learn from uh, mm. I, in, It's interesting, your course is in English language, is it? Okay, but you are looking for, is it? Yes. Okay. Now, now <coughs> we are recording for this purpose, so <coughs> international students will know more about uh, your department, uh, so you can attract of them. Of course, we want to have uh, <coughs> international students from uh, different countries uh, to our faculty. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, you, uh, you just mentioned that you have uh, four or five departments. Five departments. Five departments. Uh, so uh, all the uh, teaching is in English language? We have in Turkish, mm -hmm. uh, in four departments, and we have language, uh, English in one department. But uh, English literature has to be in English, is it? Yes. Okay. Uh, okay. Where is the list of courses? Can I have um, take photo for the list of courses? Uh, we have a course here. It has about the university. This is about the education faculty. Mm -hmm. this is and these are the departments. Oh, okay. Of here course, is the, the language is Turkish here. No problem. Let's. I think they can translate our friends. Uh, okay. And the cost here is, as far as I know, the the cost for all departments for international students is four thousand dollar per. Four thousand dollar. Maybe we can get information from our international relation office. Okay, they have more. Do they have a uh, seat here? Okay. Maybe they have. Okay. This Mr. Nurullah is that. Is he there? I think Mr. Nurullah know more, uh, more about international students' costs, something like yeah, that. Yeah. Yes, I guess. But you are you know more about the course itself, program? Yes, we okay. have no, uh, information about our department. Mm -hmm. uh, I have studied in the preschool education department. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, this, uh, this is teacher, uh, all of these are your lecturers. Faculty. Okay, interesting, interesting. Thank you, all the best. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you.